So next up we've got Kumar of India in the Robbie Gonzalez of the United States. Kumar, the Indian national champion. Gonzalez, US national champion in 2018, won the Olympic trials in 2019. So a bit of pressure on Gonzalez here, I think. Ring B has been a happy hunting ground for the USA. Becky of Hungary, the referee. This is our penultimate find of the session. Been an interesting session, this. There's been some really, really fascinating fights. None more so than that last one. Just looked to flick the jab there early on, Gonzalez. Low hands. Solid look to him. Satchin with those gloves a little bit higher. Out of the southpaw stance. Let's try and come in from the outside there. Springing in with the jab there, Gonzalez. Got that kind of tense look to his style, that fast twitch style. Jab just hitting the glove so far. Ladies and gentlemen, in the bout number 268 in the ring eight, the winner of points by split decision is the boxer on the Representing the Republic of just not really getting any punches off at the minute, but as I said, all of this from Gonzalez is, is coming up short. Just keeping it on the outside. But this lead hand's on, even nearly getting there. Truthfully, reaching with the right hand there, kind of chased that in a little bit. He's got to get his feet there. Way through the first round, and I don't think anybody's landed anything yet. Plenty thrown by Gonzalez anyway. Sachin's barely thrown a thing. Those were left to the body there, I don't think that quite made it either. And at the moment, Gonzalez is winning the round because He's throwing more punches, he's more aggressive, he's, he's holding that middle. Even though these are all hitting gloves, every single one of them. Greater work rate and intent will win him around at the moment, with a minute to go. Look for a big overhand left there, Sachin. We've been waiting for him to pull the trigger and he definitely did there. Seconds of the round, and oh, he's got his shoulders his round. He spends for that jab, flip with that jab right from the beginning. He's throwing plenty of them, but none of them have got there. Left hand, counter left hand there from Sachin, got through. That's the cleanest punch of the round. Cleanest punch of the round, right at the end there from the Indian fighter. And that might be enough, that might be enough for some of the judges because. Okay, he didn't really throw much. Gonzalez threw a lot more, but Gonzalez didn't really land with anything. He gets it with three out of the five judges there, Gonzalez. <laughs> so into the second, three two split in the scoring in that first round. Gonzalez coming out on the better side of it, the USA fighter in blue. <laughs> Sachin of India in red. Gonzalez did the same thing again here. And leading off with the left hook. Again, just catches the gloves. Right hand on the inside there for Gonzalez. Sachin's just looking to come to him and suit the American as well.
there from Sachin. Sweeping left hand. Clip Gonzalez. That's a good jab there from Gonzalez. That reached nicely, got through the guard. Sachi comes forward. Fighter in blue just released the right hand. Hook's just colliding there. Lead. He was short with it though. Sachi came back with a left jab there from Gonzalez. Again, this has been another another tight round. Left hand on the inside there from Gonzalez. Sachi has landed some single shots in his second himself as well. 30 seconds to go. Jab looked a bit low there from Gonzalez. at the end of the round. Two cards at 20 points to 18 for Gonzalez. Gonzalez from Las Vegas, Nevada. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your third final round. Three weeks ago today actually for Fury Wilder. Unbelievable evening that was. On the jab again, Gonzalez. to the body there from Gonzalez. Maybe he hasn't got down to the body with a jab enough actually. Particularly in those early stages in that opening round. Let's try and squeeze that right hand through the middle. There we go again. Jab downstairs. Always a good shot I think. Swinging right hand there from Sachin. He's gradually got his feet closer throughout the course of this fight, Gonzalez. Bit by bit by bit. Right hand on the move there from the American. Nice one too as Sachin came in. Goes for the right hand lead there, Gonzalez. A little bit of showboating maybe as it was caught by a big left hand from Sachin, but he got through a left of his own there, Gonzalez. This is heating up a bit now. Got slightly cocky there, Gonzalez, maybe left to the body. That was a good punch. I think he's annoyed with himself. He's responded well because he just picked up those knees a little bit, turned square, looked for the right hand lead. And Sachin just boshed him with the right hand. We don't just temerity. going into the third round. Gonzalez had a lead on two cards by two points, so he's won on those two cards. Whatever happens in this round, because worst case, he's lost this round 10-9. I don't think he has myself. Three other cards drawn at 19-19, so he needs one of them. Sachin needs all three of them. Gonzalez, I would say, he's won that third and final round, so he will go through to the next round. And
got better and better as the fight went on. It was maybe a bit tight, possibly a bit nervous in that in that first round because, as I said, he just jabbed gloves endlessly. Gonzalez gets in. Oh, it's going to be the final round. One judge goes.